Hey, good evening, everybody, and welcome back to the Land of Enchantment. I'm Jay Tuss, and our Bronco Roundup coverage is only beginning to ramp up. You know, tomorrow the Broncos will look to find a little bit of that magic in Albuquerque that made Boise State one of the winningest programs in college football history. The guys arrived down here in Albuquerque right around 4 o'clock this evening. This is actually the first time that Boise State has opened up with back-to-back -back road games since 2011. Boy, were those the glory days, and tomorrow the Broncos will try to uphold the standard in the past by continuing to dominate against New Mexico. Tomorrow, Boise State will also stare across the sideline at a familiar face. Former San Diego State head coach Rocky Long gave up his post with the Aztecs two years ago to return to New Mexico and do what he loves most. Yeah, he is uh, like literally one of the greatest defensive minds in college football. Like some of the stuff he's done has been completely innovated and has bled into even stuff we do here on defense. He only cares about like being the greatest defensive coordinator. He was a head coach before and was like, no, I don't want to be head coach. Like, I just want to be a defensive coordinator. I just want to call the defense and stop the run. And he's going to do everything in his power to not let us run the ball. The coach, uh, in my opinion, top five defensive coach in the history of college football. And they've got more talent than they had a year ago. They're playing extremely confident. They're doing some crazy stuff. He's as wacky as he's ever been. And um, they are going to pose a tremendous threat to us. And if we don't have a great week of prep, they will cause a lot of problems. Coming up tomorrow, we have a jam-packed Bronco Roundup game day show. Who starts at QB? Who are the Boneyard Boys? And how is BSU breaking fundraising records? We're going to answer all that and more live from Albuquerque from 6 to 7 p.m.